It's another fine edition of reacting to SML, and today we're reacting to the new SML movie, Junior the Boxer. So I wonder how this is gonna go. Um, I'm gonna want to let you guys know I have a live stream I'm doing tomorrow and Sunday because tomorrow is for the Left 4 Dead 2 live stream, part 98, and then part 99 on Sunday, which is which is for the 16 year anniversary. And then who knows what will be next? But then. Other than that, um, I also got some good news, guys. I ha I am officially taken again. I am dating. An I am dating another lady now. I am happy, and I have. I will be uploading another video later on tonight. So let's can the chatter and get into this reaction. You guys ready? I'm ready. Let's react to this. So, guys, what do you want to do today? I don't know, Hold dude. on, guys, I got something. I'm coming. Cody, you just interrupted Joseph. Yeah, dude. But I got grouch couch. Let Joseph finish. So, Joseph, is there anything you want to do today? Hmm. I don't know, dude. I'm bored. All right, Cody, now is there anything you want to do today? You guys want to play grouch couch? <gasps> What's grouch couch? It's a board game about a grouchy couch. If Chef Pee Pee was the couch, he'd be grouchy. It's the furniture with attitude game. <gasps> this couch is red just like my couch. If Chef Pee Pee was the couch, he'd be grouchy. And look, it says grouch couch will come alive and eat your treats. <laughs> if Chef Pee Pee was a couch, he'd be grouchy. We heard you. It wasn't funny. That's why we didn't react. Well, damn. Um, so how do you play? Oh, oh, well, I, I think you just feed them treats or whatever. <gasps> oh, wow, it says you can play with five or more people. What? N no, Junior, that says you have to be five years old or older to play. Five or more people would be insane. A hundred people could play this game. That would mean the entire world could play this game, but four people couldn't. Oh, okay, I see now. It says five plus age. Yeah, so you guys want to play Grouch Couch? Nah. nah. Okay, never mind. No, let's just watch TV. Yeah, Jesus. Hey there, would you like to make a hundred million dollars or give it to charity? Well, tonight, we're going to have the Box Mike Tyson for Charity event. Now, if you submit your name, tonight we're going to have a raffle. And if your name is chosen, you get to Box Mike Tyson. And if you win, you get a hundred million dollars. But if you lose, it goes to charity. I want to see one thing go. What the fuck died? Yeah, I'm gonna eat your children. I'm gonna step on your freaking testicles, and then when you're on the brink of death, oh, I'm gonna bottle your last breath and put it out to sea. It's gonna wash up on a random island with some random stranger who's almost on the brink of death himself. He's starving. He's thirsty. He needs something to eat. He sees the bottle. He opens it. He needs something to drink in there. Is it? Is it? No, no. It's your breath, and then you possess him, right? Oh, now you're him, and then you're stuck on the island for like weeks, no months, until you're on the brink of death, right? And then, and then you see a helicopter in the air. No, no, a plane. You think it's a rescue plane? Is that a rescue plane? No, it's me. I hop out with a parachute with my boxing gloves with it to beat your ass again. <laughs> yeah. So if you want that to happen to you, submit your name now. Whoa, guys, we should enter our name in that drawing so one of us can fight Mike Tyson. I'm not entering that shit. Yeah, dude, you're asking to be buried. But we could win a hundred million dollars. If you beat Mike Tyson, which you're not gonna do. But what if I punch him in the right spot on his temple, like right on the side of his head and knock him out? Well, he's not just gonna let you do that, Junior. He's gonna beat your ass. Yeah, he eats ears for a living, dude. But guys, we could win a hundred million dollars. But you could also die. Well, uh, well, if I die, they donate a hundred million dollars to charity and I'll be in the history books for that big donation. Well, yes, but Junior, I don't think you understand just how much of a killing machine he is. Like, let me show you some of his old fights from the 90s. Like, let me show you his fight with Archibald put up your Dukes Hamilton the third. Oh, bro, that was a sick knockout. Yeah, he killed him. Watch. Hey, 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 I say good sir. Put up your Dukes. I challenge you to fisticuffs. Oh, easy fucking day. Your shoes is a tie. Oh, my word, is it? <laughs> Yeah, I'm a champ again! <laughs> I can't be stopped! He has ear munching time! Where's the cheese dip? <laughs> Whoa, dude, he killed his ass! There go Big Mike! Yeah, Junior, he punched over the body. Big hands McGee. Boxer with a normal sized body, but abnormally baby sized hands. I'm here with Baby Hands McGee. How do you feel about the fight, Baby Hands? You know, I'm feeling pretty good. My hands may be small, but I'm gonna beat Mike Tyson's ass. Okay, good luck with that. Ding ding, fight! <laughs> The best ever! Who can beat me? Nobody! It's the ear munching time, bitch! <laughs> Wow, he killed Baby Hands McGee. Yeah, doesn't that convince you not to fight, Junior? Uh, well, no, because he had very tiny hands. He didn't have a chance. Okay, okay, well then let me show you his fight with Clarence the Giant. Clarence the Giant? Yeah, he had a huge height advantage. Yeah, he was favored to win, dude. But watch the outcome. 
I'm here with Clarence the Giant. How you feeling, Clarence? My mom got a pet parrot named Dodo. Cool. Let's talk to Mike Tyson. Hey, Mike, how do you feel about parrots having a pet parrot named Dodo? Oh, parrots are cool, but pigeons are the ultimate fucking birds. So I might unfortunately have to beat his ass. <laughs> well, well, how do you feel about him being bigger than you? Oh, it's nothing. It's like James and the Giant Peach. <laughs> I'm James, and he's the Giant Peach. It's time to mix some fucking PJ. Watch out, old man. <laughs> okay. Ding, ding. Fight. <laughs> See, Junior, there he goes, eating up ears left and right. Like, literally, the left ear and the right ear. Yeah, he can't be stopped, dude. So you really want to fight that guy? I don't want to fight him. I guess at least enter my name into the raffle, and if God picks my name, then I'll fight him. So you're going to leave it up to God? It's not God deciding, Junior. It's a raffle. I know, but if my name just so happens to get chosen, then it's my turn to try to get $100 million and knock out Mike Tyson. You don't have to do this. I want to do it because I want a chance to win $100 million. So, look, I'm going to let God decide. All right. Okay, I put my name in the hat. Wait, what? Yeah, like, they're, they're downstairs with a hat. Oh, okay. <gasps> oh, look, the result of the drawing! Hey there, it's time for the drawing to see who to fight Mike Tyson. I've got a hat full of names here, but not too many, though. I guess not many people ain't beat up by Mike Tyson. Yeah, a lot of idiots in this hat. <laughs> now let's see who the lucky winner is. More like unlucky. Hmm. Let's see. I have Junior. No last name or address or anything, but if your name is Junior, come on down. Hey, cameraman, get a little closer. Huh. Hey, Julia, you're going to fucking die. I'm going to bottle up your last breath, sit it out to see some swimming guy on the island. Right, Mike, you already said that. Well, well Julia, you're going to fucking die. Yeah, get casket ready, buddy. So come on down in the next five minutes. Yeah, practice taking your last breath. <laughs> Guys, I won. I actually won. But, but did you really win, though? Did you want to win, though? I mean, guys, I mean, God picked my name, and it, it, it's my turn. Yeah, it's your turn to get brutally murdered. No, guys, listen, I could possibly win $100 million if I just hit Mike Tyson right in the temple, just right, like, right here, I could knock him out. Jesus, you don't even know anything about boxing, Junior. You haven't trained. Well, I mean, I know, I know that... That. No, no, Junior, at least go have a training montage. A training montage? Yeah, even if it's only 10 seconds, please, just have a quick montage so you at least know something. <sighs> okay. Okay. Feeling good. That was a really nice montage. I don't know. I think it should have been longer. All right, guys. Who's going to come with me to my fight? Uh, not me, dude. I'll watch it on TV. My bad. Wait, wait you don't want to come, like, be in my ring and, like, you know, rub my shoulders? Like, come on, champ. I'm not rubbing a dude's shoulders. And I don't want to see, you you know, croak. You feel me? So I got to place a parlay on you, bro. Play a parlay. Is, it, is he betting against me? Yeah, I think he's betting against you. Oh, uh, okay, okay. Well, um, Cody, you want to come watch me fight? Yeah, sure. Fuck it. I can give you CPR. Put my tongue in your mouth. Hey, it's me, Junior. I'm the guy for the Mike Tyson event. Wait a minute. This is you? Picture this. You're sitting at home alone watching YouTube videos. Yeah. Okay, good. We've been waiting for you. Oh, well, you don't have to check my ID to make sure I'm the real junior? No, we don't have time for all that. The fight's tonight. We gotta get started. So what we're doing here is a press conference. So I'm gonna ask you a few questions to get people interested in the fight, because not a lot of people know this is going on, because this is all very, very sudden. Uh, okay. Okay, so first question, Junior. What are you gonna do to Mike Tyson? I'm gonna hit him in the face a lot. Oh, big words. What do you think of that, Mike? <laughs> How sweet. You remind me of a little teddy bear I had as a kid. <laughs> I ripped his fucking head off when I was four years old and ate his insides because I was hot candy. And it wasn't. So I'm mad. I'm really mad. And I'm gonna rip your head off and eat your insides like it's cotton candy. And if it's not, I'll murder your whole family. Well, Junior, what do you think of Mike Tyson killing you and eating your insides like cotton candy? I thought this was a boxing match. It is. This is how he boxes. So how many rounds do you think the fight's gonna go? How long is a boxing match usually? Twelve rounds! No, I think it's gonna last... 12 rounds. <laughs> In his sweetest fucking dreams. <laughs> hey, do me a favor, say something. Say Mississippi. Mississippi. <laughs> yeah, you'll be dead before Ippy, bitch. You hear that, folks? Dead before Ippy. Now let's go to the ring and get this fight started. Uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Hello and welcome to the Mike Tyson Charity Boxing Match. In the blue corner, at 5 feet 10 inches and weighing 220 pounds, Mike Tyson. <laughs> Yes, I'm Mike here, Mr. Melatonin Mike, because I'm about to put his ass to sleep with Tylenol PM and NyQuil. <laughs> Somebody give him a CPAP machine for all that sleep apnea, yes. <laughs> oh, it's going to be the easiest night of sleep he ever fucking has. <laughs> oh, I'm going to rip his hair off and put some salt and pepper on that motherfucker. Oh, and Pap Weaker. 
Sugar, because I love seasoning. Oh, and then I'm going to wash it down with a nice-ass Sprite. I love a good beverage. Oh, it's going to be a perfect-ass dinner. And in the red corner, a kid named Junior. That's right. It's me, Junior, and I'm about to knock him out and get paid. Let's get this fight underway, folks. All right, I want a nice, clean fight. No hitting below the belt and no biting anybody's ear off. I'm talking to you, Mike Tyson. Oh, we're biting ears off today. Yeah, it's an all-you-can-eat ear buffet. <laughs> Bring me that fucking ear. No, 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 none of that, okay? So it's going to be 12 rounds. I mean, let's be fucking honest. It's going to be like four seconds. I would last longer in bed with Margot Robbie than this is going to take. Anything you two want to say to each other before you fight? Oh, it's going to be real quick. I'm going to tuck you in very nicely, give you a pacifier, and knock you the fuck out. Put you right in bed. <laughs> then I'm going to go home and feed my damn pigeons. <laughs> I would be fucking terrified if I were you. You okay. should be. Get ready. Three, two, one, fight! Fuck. <laughs> I'm the best! I'm the fucking champion! I'm the best ever! Who think, he thinks he's Sonny Listen? I'm Jack Dancy! I'm a fucking monster! I'm gonna rip off your heart and eat it! Praise me to Allah! Hold on. Let me, let me see if I can get him up. Uh, Holy shit, two black eyes with one punch? Kid, are you sure you want to do this? Yeah. Better stay down, it's in your best interest. Uh, kid, what day is it? July. Jesus, kid, I think you should probably just quit. <laughs> Give me that fucking ear! I don't care! No, 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 back, back, Mr. Tyson! Give me a thousand island! I'm hungry, and he's a fucking protein! Give me that ear! No, back, back, no, Mike Tyson, stop, stop trying to bite his ear, let him breathe. Fuck it! Jesus, kid, you really shouldn't do this. I want to keep going, put me in, coach. Fuck it, okay, come on. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Uh, I'm ready, coach. Hey, turn around, he's that way. <laughs> Where? Yeah, line them up for me. Uh, where do you want them? <laughs> uh, a little to the left. Oh, okay. Uh, nah, to the one, to the one. Uh, all right. Cool. Hey, yeah, perfect. Okay, get ready? Go. <laughs> <laughs> Can't be stopped. It's your time, motherfucker. No, 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 no. Hey, no, Mike. Mike, you spit him out. Give me the glove. Give me the glove. Give me the glove. Mike, you rub it. Rub it. Hey, hey, hey. What the glove? You want the glove? You want the glove? Go get that glove. Come on, kid. Let's get the hell out of here. Our winner by knockout and eaten ear is Mike Tyson. Yeah, I am Mike the fucking best. The champ. The best ever. I got a belly full of ear. Oh, I'm be full all night. Sleeping good, baby. Yeah. Somebody call a doctor to get my stomach checked for ear infection. <laughs> all right, kid. I brought you home. Did I win the fight? No, but you did get your ear bitten off by Mike Tyson, which is a rare privilege. Dang it, dude. I lost my bet. Wait, you actually bet on Junior to win? No, I bet on him to get knocked out in the first punch, but he lasts two punches. I can't believe it. Did I get the money? No, but what you did get is CTE, brain damage. So you have that to look forward to. Man, I'm so grouchy right now. I feel like Chef Pee Pee when he's a couch. <laughs> Fucking what? All right, that's my question. Who do you th think will win, Jake Paul or Mike Tyson? I will be honest with you guys. I think Mike Tyson's gonna win. I. I'm not a big fan of Jake Paul. I mean, he's okay for me. But I like Logan Paul, too. But at the same time, you know. So, yeah. Sorry, I had to switch. Like, after an ad came up, I had to switch my spot because uh, apparently my camera's almost dead. And I didn't notice until, like, the last possible second. And it was kind of stupid, you know. So, get ready for the, for the two live streams happening tomorrow and Sunday. So, thank you, everybody, so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, punch the like button, subscribe until I believe you're strong. Put a comment down below if you guys love SML. And fight away that subscribe button. And thank you very much for watching. As always, I'll see you guys in my next video. Austin Louis Berry, L.A. Night. Yeah. Let's go, Mike Tyson. He's going to win. Hopefully. Thanks for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, punch the like button, subscribe until I believe you're strong. Put a comment down below if you guys love SML. And fight away that subscribe button. And thank you very much for watching. As always, I'll see you guys in my next video. Austin Louis Berry. L. A. Night. Yeah. Let's go, Mike Tyson. He's going to win. Hopefully.